in Weems writes, in each heart lies a Bethlehem, an inn where we must ultimately answer whether there is room or not. This season that we enter into, it's hectic, it's busy, life happens fast. It's so easy to fill our hearts with stuff of this world. And we tend to get distracted by that stuff. And we tend to, to miss out on what happens around us. We tend to miss out on the reason for the season. We tend to fill our hearts with stuff like greed, stress, anxiousness, worry, material things. And all of that tends to take over our hearts. And eventually we crash. We don't know where to go. We don't know what to do. This season, I invite you to, to approach Christmas, to approach Advent in a different way. This season, I invite you to fill your heart with something different, something greater, something that is life-giving. This Christmas, I invite you to enter into the world, having made room in the end of your heart for Jesus. The next three Wednesdays, beginning tomorrow, December 4th at 10 o'clock a.m., you're invited into the sanctuary of Mount Olivet United Methodist Church to journey with us as we listen for the voice of God speaking through scriptures. During our Advent scripture readings, we'll have opportunities to meditate with one another upon the holy scriptures of this season and to listen for what God is saying to us through them. We'll have opportunity to reflect in community what we hear God saying. And we will together explore what these sacred texts that we hear this time of year, every year, what these sacred texts are saying to us and how they help us to make room in the end of our heart for Jesus. So I invite you to journey with us, journey with us to the manger and decide in the end of your heart, is there room for Jesus? O come, O come, Emmanuel.